Hey everybody, welcome to the channel. My name is Megan. Today we're in Florida and we are at Publix. You guys have never been to Publix. Today's the first day. So I'm gonna show you around. I am gonna buy some things while we're here because we need the groceries. Uh, not a whole lot. We've got a little here and there, but we need some. And I'm looking around and there's a lot of exciting things going on in these parts. So let's go looking around Publix, come on. Well, first off, you know that we're very close to Disney because they have rows and rows of Disney fun. So if the kids didn't get their stuffed animals, those are here. If they need sunglasses, those are here. If you need creams and lotions, my heavens, they are here. They've got sun bum. They know what's what. Okay. Banana boat. Got to get your aloe vera. You can even get postcards here. Do people still send postcards? How fun is that? Also, you can grab your cute little mini shoes. You can get some cute shirts for the kids that have Mickey on them. Hey, this is a really great way to actually probably save some good money. You're gonna save by coming to Publix instead of getting your things at Disney and you still get to play the part. Anybody need a purse? Minnie's gonna set you up. Anybody need a little travel pillow? That's here too. Backpacks. That's cute, I don't do matching shirts. I'm grumpy, don't make me worse. 100% you've gotta to come to Publix to get your ears. I can't believe this. These are only $9.99. Inside of Disney, they're about $40. These are fantastic. Beach towels. We'll be going to the beach soon. Yes. PJs. I'm a little confused about the whole stitch thing going on. Like they're really working that one over lately. We were at the pool and I saw some of these. You clip them to the top of your chair and it keeps your towel from blowing away, which I think is really brilliant. It makes total sense. $10.99 for the Boca clips. Yesterday was the first time that I had noticed anybody having these. They look like uh, pineapples. You've got your flip flops and your quick throw on shoes, your hats. Ooh, I do like this one. That one's cute. Swim shoes, water shoes. Oh, yes. We're gonna grab the Mott's 100% apple juice, 421. Woo, that's pricey. And um, I have to get this. this. The kids are taking some liquid vitamin stuff that it just needs juice for it or it doesn't taste very good. So 421 for this guy. Grape fibers, high in dietary fiber. Gives you 100% of your daily fiber needs. What am I even looking at? It's not grape juice, it's grape fibers. It looks smooth, so it doesn't look chunky, that's good. $5.15, have you ever had such a thing and have you ever seen such a thing? We've got aloe vera drinks too. $1.45 for those, those will make you feel nice and fresh on the inside. Pear nectar, passion fruit. And just like at most grocery stores, you have a nice Valentine section here. So you can get the ones you love something. You can send me something. I know we love each other, it's okay. I have now seen several of these tables where they've got things in bins. They're kind of putting stuff together, which is cool. It's looking like when you're gonna save on things, they put it like this. I like that, it makes it easy. But you do have to watch out because sometimes they'll trick you. This will look like a great deal because it's in these bins, but it's not always compare those prices, my friends. I almost passed out. I thought that this one little thing of strawberries in a heart shape was $10. It's three for $10, but how cute. They've got a whole thing that you could get like some fun stuff for Valentine's Day. This is a cake here. New York style cheesecake, six inch with fresh strawberries. They've got the little strawberry guys. They got chocolate dip. What do we have? This is a little glaze for strawberries. We've got chocolate covered strawberries. What are those macarons? Um, a little sangria in a can. We've got Chardonnay and chocolates. I mean, I love a good display and they have displayed it well over here. Emotional support fries, you guys. <laughs> um, we've been talking so much lately. We absolutely love fries in our family. If we could give up anything else um, to get McDonald's fries, we totally would. There's something about them that's just magical. Plant a kiss on me, she sings, okay. And then we've got heat resistant oven mitts. The perfect man, here he is. Is anybody looking? He's sweet and definitely rich. Just how a man ought to be, it says. I love chocolate. Okay, now that's just silly. We will be doing a Valentine's Day shop with me because we do enjoy celebrating Valentine's Day. I know it's not for everybody, but we enjoy it. Just like something fun to connect with your family. We love it. Super Bowl's getting ready too, so don't forget about that as if you could. We've got chips galore, we've got soda. Down here we've got avocados because you're probably gonna wanna make some guacamole for all the chips. You can do a football cake, you can do popcorn, you can do um, lager. Look at that cake. Don't get that one, he's cracked. How about that one? Go team. 
Who are we rooting for? Who are we rooting for? Is it the Chiefs? They have quite a deal going on right here. Buy two, get two free, the packs of soda. The 12 pack of Pepsi products. Wow, save $19.18 on four of them when you buy it. Hot dog. Buy one, get one free on the Doritos. They're $6.99, you guys. We can get that at a better deal at Costco or Sam's Club. Just saying, but if you can't do that and you got Publix, well, here's your moment. I feel like these punch keys are really a thing here. I don't know that I've ever noticed them so many places. These are the raspberry four count, $4.99. And you definitely know that you've come to the right place when the Cheesecake Factory has an entire display of their yumminess. We like it all. We do. We love the Cheesecake Factory bread. The brown bread is a win. Cheese for days. What is this? The big moo. Heat and eat bacon, bacon, baked cheese. What? The big moo baked cheese is six dollars and forty nine cents. You're saving two eighty on that one. And Publix, of course, has a bakery, and they also have a deli. You can get is that chicken I see rotisserie or fried? Fried, I think. Oh yeah, fried. You can also get fried chicken tenders, oven roasted chicken up here, six ninety nine for that. Lemon pepper or original or mojo, seasoned with lime, garlic, and spices. Johanna and Marky love the chicken. Izzy does too, actually and George our dog, but you know what? He's not here with us. How gorgeous is this produce area? You guys, my eyes are so happy right now. Like if I worked at a grocery store, I'd want it to look like this. It's so beautiful. The wall of salad would make any person's heart happy. We've got Cheddar Ranch, we've got French Bistro, meow, guacamole crunch, Mexican street corn. I'm kind of looking for a bag of lettuce just to have. Mama needs lettuce feeling the desire. I did have some at Olive Garden last night though. I'm gonna grab a classic salad blend. It's 307 for the bag. I typically use like olive oil and balsamic vinegar so I might grab a, a small balsamic vinegar if I can. Although Izzy really likes it too but you know what we like is the Olive Garden dressing. I'm gonna look for that. Look at all the Panera ones they have. Caesar poppy seed, the lemon balsamic poppy seed again, and the Fuji apple, a favorite. That's an easy one to make a good dinner. You grill up some chicken, and then you get your salad with some Fuji apple there, maybe add a little topping, and you've got Panera at home for way cheap. An entire wall of salsa goodness from organic to not, from medium to medium hot. Oh wow, for really hot right here. Willie's is really hot, careful. I mean, seriously, look at this wall. Is that not gorgeous? You know you're in Florida when you have this much options for orange juice. There are so many. It would be amazing to have like some fresh orange juice, homemade, but that's that's probably not gonna happen right now. You gotta do what you gotta do when you're on vacation. I'm gonna grab a big one of these um, Simply Orange. This is pulp free and it is $7.75 for the big old, this is 89 ounces. And we gotta get some gorgeous strawberries. These are beautiful. Three for 10, well, I guess we have to buy three, but I'm not going to be forced into such things. Although I might be, because it's good to have just some quick stuff. We can finish one of these in like a day. I saw a video of this lady talking about um, these fresh foods that she got. She's like, can you believe that, it, that we eat them within a week? It's so fast. And I'm like, oh yeah, I'd eat that in a day. <laughs> these are some of our favorites. These are pine berries, like the pinka berries. They're so fun, they're so yummy. They're supposed to be kind of pinkish white. The more pink, the sweeter, I think. I think we'll come back for these and maybe get them for Valentine's Day. That'll be fun. Ooh, 70 cents a pound for bananas. Little bit on the root side, friends, that's a lot. Probably could get them at cheaper at Sam's Club or Costco, but I'm gonna plead the whole vacation thing. Like, we can't be going to stores all day, every day. By the way, Publix, we love you. Look at this cup holder right here, brilliant. I saw that on all of the carts. That was a good thought. Someone asked in the comments if we were vegetarian, and we are not. We definitely eat meat. I do have a child that doesn't eat meat, just a texture kind of can't do it kind of a thing. But no, we eat meat, but we also eat a lot of fruits and veggies and a lot of Lucky Charms. Imagine that. We've been eating eggs and sugar cereals for breakfast. It's amazing. Maybe some donuts thrown in there, not gonna lie. But I thought we could get one of these maple and brown sugar instant oatmeal packs. They're four seventy nine dollars for this one. Ooh, they do have it in the store brand. Do we get crazy and give it a try? Okay, this is a 10 pack for $2.46. The name brand is an eight pack for $4.79. Let's get crazy. We're gonna just try out the store brand. Why not? Publix might know what they're doing. $2.46, let's do it. 
Also, I bought some waffles, but we haven't been able to eat them because we don't have much syrup. We're gonna try Publix syrup. Original syrup, 24 fluid ounces, 3.59. Promise me I'm not making a bad choice. Ooh, we really like Log Cabin. We're gonna be brave though today. We're gonna be brave. We're gonna go for the original for 3.59. It seems like Green Wise is a thing here. I cannot tell if that is a Publix brand. Let's find out. It says distributed by Publix. It's the Publix guarantee. Okay. So to me, it seems like this is a Publix brand. I'm seeing quite a bit of the green wise. These are organic over in this section. What? Wheaties for $7.55. We have a store in our area that's pretty pricey. That might even hit pricier than ours. Wow. I'm actually incredibly surprised. I don't think I've ever seen the cereal aisle quite so big. Even Walmart in our area is not this big. It's quite shocking. Now, wait a minute. This over here is the public cereal. So maybe the green wise is the organic and this one is just the regular. I've had a lot of you tell me that you love Tate's cookies and they have an entire situation going on here from the little tiny Tate's down at the bottom to cookie bark up at the top. I gotta tell you something. I'm very visual and I love how Publix is stocking everything. This is the most beautiful stocked situation that I have seen in a very long time anywhere. I mean, everything is just gorgeous. It makes you want to buy things when it's all neat and tidy like this. It really does. Like even my self-control is waning because I'm going, look how pretty it is. I should get it. Way to go Publix. This looks like the Italian food section. I'm all about that. For sure, look at these little rosemary or olive oil, traditional Italian snack cracker. Tara Lee. Tara, Tara Lee? Tara Lee. Mm-hmm, yeah. And then of course I need to look at the things that include chocolate and there they are. What is this, tartlets, raspberry tartlets. Ooh, lemon tartlets. Oh, walk away, Megan. Of course we do candy here, lots of candy always. And they have Haribo, so we know this is a proper store. Absolutely. I saw these export sodas at Sam's Club and I thought it was really interesting. I'd never seen it before, but they have different ones that are called sodas. So Keebler makes export sodas. It looks very similar to maybe a saltine. Yeah. I wanted to have a look at the chicken breast just to see what prices are we thinking over here. Let's just look at the normal chicken breast. Okay. $5.48 a pound. Oh, that's a lot. That's a lot compared to where I'm from. Now, once we get into like the Just Bear, these always start costing more. But I'd say the food is looking yummy. Now, these say green wise on them. Why do they say that? I did look it up, and yes, it means that it's an organic product. Plus, there's lots of other cool things about it. So, you'll have to check it out. Google Publix Green Wise, and you'll find out more. Bone broth over here in the cold section with all the meat. That's a kind of smart place to put it. Butcher's bone broth, organic chicken bone broth. You're saving two bucks. Oh, they've got ponchos here because they know that one minute is sunny and the next minute it's raining and then it's sunny again. Inflatables for days. We've got balls. We've got little riders. We have air mats. Really fun ones down here with the dragon and the turtle. Very smart to get your goggles. The kids have used their goggles a ton. Here's the balsamic vinegar. I'm just going to get this one. $2.79. It'll be perfect. They gave us these tiny little pepper packets, but we're nearly out of them because we've been making eggs and seasoning it up. $2.79 for this little cutie. And you'd be shocked to know, but we still eat a lot of noodles even on vacation. <laughs> and we didn't find any seasoning. We've looked other places and now we're just gonna get this one. We like the one with the blue top. So I'm hoping that this one will be okay. Ooh, let's hope, $3.79. Yes, look at the teeny tiny little Hidden Valley Ranch. This is $2.79, it's perfect. Did you have any idea that there could be this many hot sauces? I mean, it just goes on and on and on. In Tabasco, we've got so many hot sauces. I didn't know that there were this many options in the world, but clearly I've been proven wrong today. This place really seems to have everything. I'm quite surprised. You could make so many things. It would be so interesting to try all the different things. Could anybody ever do it all? I don't know, but maybe. They've got Florida local stuff here. Heart bees? I don't know. Orchard pond honey. The pond part throws me off. Is that a good idea? Maybe. Sassy Q. How many of you feel like you're a little bit sassy Q? Key West style Cuban marinade. We've got coffees that are local. Salsa. Corn chips. What? I have never seen Parmesan cheese like this. 
It's in a little glass jar. It's got a fun design to it. No cellulose powder. You can also do it like that. Oh, never seen it come like that. I usually just grate it myself. So maybe that's why. We'll know if this is a truly good store if they have Barilla and they sure done do. Look at that. We love you Barilla, but we already have some. We're not buying you today. Have you seen so many sauces? This is all pasta sauce. All of it, it's not done yet. There's more, there's more. What? That organic green wise is here again. Look at the bean wall. I want a bean feast. Did any of you ever wonder when you watched Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory, Veruca saying that she wanted a bean feast? Why did she want a bean feast? What child would want this? But it's like a deal. It's like, it means like we're gonna have a party. The songs we sing, but we don't know the meaning of, are like, why would she want a bean feast? Well, now I know. She wants a party. Makes a lot of sense. All kinds of kitchen things from silverware to cookware to knives. They've got it all. They have got it all. You can also get your shampoos and your soaps your makeups. You remember when we went to Ulta right before we left and I got my stuff for my eyebrows? Well, let me tell you what, it's not waterproof. And I had no problems when we came the last time. It was the same stuff, or at least I thought it was. No, I've had eyebrows up to here a few times after I come back from the pool. Like I must have swiped up. I was looking some kind of way. I kept wondering, why are people looking at me so weird? Mm, no, I know. You can get your deodorants. Oh my goodness, I was at Target and I saw that Native is now selling Girl Scout cookie scented deodorant. Limited time only, they had Thin Mints. The coconut caramel actually smelled really good. Very coconutty. I mean, if I was a Native user, I probably would get those scents. I'm not, but if I were, I might. Oh, now we're going down to the kid aisle. We have, and the foot. So we have stuff for the feet. This is an everything store, my goodness. We've got diapers and diapers. We've got stuff if you're not feeling well. Stuff for the teeth, gotta keep those teeth happy. Toothpaste. Ooh, they just had these at Aldi, the pretzilla, pretzel bites. These are uh, buy one, get one free right now. $6.99 is what you're gonna save. I think that might be a better deal for getting the two of them than just getting one at Aldi, if you get the sale. We've got international foods down this aisle and they're all labeled at the top. So this is going to be like all of the Mexican. Taco Bell is not Mexican, now stop it. And I guess it's the American version. Not nearly as good as the true. Mateo's is here for $3.99, not a bad price. Although those look extra hot. Yeah, extra hot habanero and medium, oof. Medium cantina style, oh. Oh, hot, medium, mild. Even the mild, my kids thought was a little on the hot side. Just a tiny bit, they still ate it, but. Tortillas of every kind, all the way down to gluten-free spinach herb. We've got carb balance, sun-dried basil, there's corn, there's flour, organic. Zero net carbs, what is this one? Chipotle? The street taco ones are fun, they're cute. Sweet Hawaiian flour, what? And then we've got beans, beans. The ma Don't make me start singing that song. We've got salsas, tahine up there, Spanish rice. We've got kosher over here. So Bamba peanut butter puffs. Look at that kid on there. <laughs> Onion flavored wheat snacks. We've got coffee and candies. Joyva, marshmallow twist. Oh yeah, gel rings. Biscuits, couscous. Ooh, that's, I'm gonna leave that for you. The sardines, 100% leaving that for you. Cause I love you, that's why. Not for any other reason, of course. More couscous, more matzo, grape juice down there, okay. Then the British. The British have a big aisle, wow. I wonder if they have a big population that comes in here. I have heard languages spoken from every, every high and low place you could ever think of. It's been amazing, I love it. We've got teas, we've got beans, we've got Thai food tea, oh. We've got rice pudding in a can. That can't be any good, can it? Yummy comb, sunflower seed bread, whole rye, Scottish shortbread. Turkish delight, just say no. No Turkish delight. What is this, orange chocolate? Oh, I love these. I've had too many treats so I'm not going to get it. Those are so good. Tim Tam, lots of you thought that that was really yummy. I thought you guys told me this was Australian though. Yeah, he was an Australian baker, okay. French butter cookies, what do we have on this part? Now we're getting into Asian. 
all things Asian. We've got noodles and sauces, sriracha. Ooh, there's a lot of sauces. All different kinds of things that you can easily take home and heat up. The Japanese barbecue sauce. You know, I haven't seen these other options. This is the original. This is hot and spicy. This is yuzu. Bean sprouts, seaweed. The seaweed's not terrible. It's not. Now we have Asian Indian. Passage to Asia, 90 second veg curry bowl. We've got all kinds of little rice packets that you can heat up and make for an easy time. And then we've got sauces that you can cook with. Oh, now we're getting into the West Indies. Slap your mama, spices, crab boil, shrimp, crawfish, shrimp, and crab boil. Complete, nothing to add, sack size. Okay, so you just shake that over all the stuff and now you're gonna be eating injectables, butter. I do find that one a little bit odd, but you know, to each their own. Corned beef, pumpkin flavored soup mix, cream crackers, water crackers, jerk barbecue sauce. Oh, now the Brazilian. Oh my word, I, I don't even know how to say all these things. Look at this. Leche de coco, hearts of palm. Now we're getting closer to South American. What do we have here? Oh, those are big things of brown sugar. I think I've used those before in some cooking that I've done. Whole figs and syrup, guava dessert, dulce de leche, little soft mints, bon bon bum. <laughs> I love it. Have you ever seen so many options for Bubba burgers? Wow, sweet onion, we've got original, we have the grass fed, we have the bacon cheddar. This whole area is all just burger type things, which is smart because I imagine maybe some people are gonna be cooking up a lot coming up here for the Super Bowl maybe, or just for the fun of it. We're going down like the pizza and the frozen food aisle. There are so many, we could never stop and look at it all. We'd have to like make a serious day of it. They have the public steamable vegetables right here. All of it, chopped turnip greens. Still haven't ever had that. Wouldn't mind if somebody who knew what they were doing could make it for me. Beans, butter beans, baby lima beans. Don't make me sing the song again, I'm not doing it. I've seen Junior's at Costco. They have Junior's cheesecake here. This one looks like a celebration cake. Look how many sprinkles. And they have the Oreo cheesecake. The original and maybe the strawberry is what I saw when I was at Costco. Oh, it's been a couple times ago. Yasso is also at Costco and it is like large and in charge here. There are so many options. Black raspberry chip, that sounds good. The entire aisle, and I mean the entire aisle, I would show you down the other way, but there's people down there, is ice cream. The entire, okay, let me see if I can do it without. All the way down, past that guy, all of it is ice cream. How in the world do they have so many options? What do you guys think about Bluebell ice cream? Have you had that? I don't think I've seen it before. If I have, I did not keep that in my brain cells. Black walnut, butter crunch, rocky road, pistachio almond, millennium crunch, excuse me, cinnamon twist, Neapolitan, cookie two-step. I'm sure they mean like a dance, but <laughs> my 12-year-old brain immediately thinks about a two-step being like, you gotta go to the bathroom number two. Now we're going into yogurt land. So many yogurt options. How does it even happen? Since we're here though, we love this Yoplait vanilla. It's really good, $6.59 for the pack of eight. Just gives us something kind of quick and easy to eat. We went through all of our water that we got at Costco really fast. So I am gonna grab one here, the purified water 32 pack. It is $4 and 62 cents and then you know, next time we go to Costco, we're gonna get more, or Sam's Club, whichever, because we're thirsty people. There's seven of us though, right? We go through it fast. All the special milks that you would need. We've got your almond, zero sugar original oat milk, sweetened, extra creamy. They have Oatly here. Now, for some reason, I thought that was a Target thing, but I was wrong, okay. Checking out their milk. So this is the Publix brand. Typically, the store brand is gonna be your cheapest bet. $4.65 for a gallon of milk, guys. You better shop at Aldi if you're gonna get your milk. That is a crazy price. Wow. I know some of you have told me your prices are crazy, but that makes my heart hurt. That's why we shop at Aldi for our milk. 
for sure. Um, sometimes Meyer will give us a good price, but Walmart every now and again will be okay for their store brand. Man, that is a big price there, my friend. What about eggs? 18 eggs, $5.69. Definitely gonna save at Aldi, 100%. You feel like Eglin's best, $4 for a 12 pack? Oh my word, this is why sometimes you just wanna buy your own chicken, but that's actually gonna cost a lot too. So for sure, I would be shopping at Aldi for my eggs, and I'm gonna continue on that thought. Bread for days, of course. Every bread you could want. Oh. Cheese, cheese, yummies. Lots of cheeses. I've seen these cake bites before, especially this Italian rainbow one. They also have Harvest Pumpkin Spice Limited Edition, Frosted Coffee Cake, Lemon Layers, the Chocolate Tuxedo, the Ultimate Party Cake, Pistachio. I had no idea that there were so many of them. We have the jellies and the peanut butters, always. Nutella, because what is life without Nutella? Down this way, we've got stuff for washing. Make sure your dishes are clean. This music here is really getting going. We've got Tide, all of our things that we need for washing clothes, all OxyClean, Arm & Hammer, Purex, cleaning products for the house. They even have air filters. Looky there. All right, okay. All right, my friends, that is the end of checking out Publix for the very first time. It's very all-inclusive. Like, I am shocked at the amount of soda and chips down there. There was like three aisles of it, guys. There is so much of everything. It's all so beautiful and neatly put away. So many options. I love it. I want to come back. So I'm going to go check out, and I'll tell you all the total for my treasures. And uh, yeah, you hold tight. Can I just say how much I love walking outside and it's warm and lovely? It's perfection. Okay, $57 was my total for all of our treasures. And I think we're gonna be set now for, for a while. <laughs> so thanks for hanging out with me, guys. Hope that you have an amazing day. If you love knowing what's new at Costco, Sam's Club, and Aldi, if you like grocery hauls, if you like checking out new stores with me, or if you don't like any of that and you just wanna hang out, you're welcome. I would love to have you here. Please subscribe to the channel. And don't forget that if you want to keep up with our Florida excitement, all of our adventures, you can pop over to my Megan Birch channel, M-E-G-H-A-N, Birch channel. And I'll put that down in the description box as well as a link to it in the pinned comment. We're having a lot of fun here. Kids are learning how to swim. Nola's getting brave in the water. Zion's getting brave. We're experiencing all sorts of things. And it's lovely. So you guys have an amazing day and I'll talk to you soon. Toodaloo!